Is that Chuck Norris? Oh, Chuck Norris. Chucky boy. All right, we have to get this. Oh, this is from Shopco. Do we have a VHS player in the uh, <laughs> hotel room? Oh, I mean, look, we got a flat screen, so probably not. Yeah. Hey, I'm Chris King of Chris King and the Gutter Balls. You're listening to Medium. What is it? Medium Monarchy. Let me try that again. <laughs> Take two. Take two. Ashes falling to the ground. James Evan Plato here from MediaMonarchy.com. We're standing in what's the awesome record exchange here in Boise with Chris King and the Gutter Balls. Chris, Malcolm, Thomas. Yes. We actually, uh, we're, we're staying in the same motel a few doors down. So we've been kicking it here at Tree Fort for a couple of days. Is this your first time here? It's my first time here. Uh, I think it's Tom's second time. Yeah. Malcolm's first time. Having a blast. Rock and roll. Yeah. Yeah. How was your set the other night? So good, so good. There's so many cool people that came out, shook their booties. Um, it's really cool to see that with our our music. I feel like I feel like they're all on mushrooms or something. Like it was a magical kind of night. You know? yeah. <laughs> Are they all on mushrooms? They could have been. They could have been. <laughs> 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 yeah. Oh, right. Yeah, that's true. And we where... dosed them all right before uh, they came in the door. Yeah. <laughs> so actually, then, what other what bands have you seen that you've that you've been digging? Uh, Smokey Brights. Um, I saw Acid King last night. Word. That was great. Cool. Um, Liz Cooper. Liz Cooper and the Stampede. Okay. Oh man, that, that was so was good. Amazing. Yeah. Um, I'm looking forward to Kill Sid Band tonight. Um, there's some good buddies from Seattle. Sweet. A lot of Seattle Seattle cats came out. So um, I, I I lived in Portland for 13 years and as yeah looking at this and planning to come up and it was like oh there's a huge huge chunk of Portland Pacific Northwest yeah, bands. Yeah. I had to. I moved to. I had to move to New Mexico last year. We needed to get closer to family, and it's been a little bit of a transition. So even being here in Boise, it's like I feel like I'm back in the Pacific <laughs> yeah, Northwest. Yeah. yeah, I love Boise, man. I'd, I'd, I'd come back here anytime. Yeah, I'm digging it. Um, Everybody's really nice. So is this is this worked into? Did you guys have other shows worked around this? A, t- a tour built around uh, this? We did stop in Richland, Washington, um, and played at this really cool place. Uh, it's like a Thai restaurant called Emerald of Siam. Um, really sweet people. The lady put us up and had like a basement for us to sleep in and stuff. Oh, sweet. There was this guy that was crashed out for like, probably like 24 hours. <laughs> so, like, he was, he was, she was he like, don't mind the like, guy in the corner. He, yeah, they just oh, had yeah. like this like... Gamer guy, I saw. Yeah, <laughs> gamer guy. He gamed too hard, but uh, yeah, that yeah, was really cool. He scared me because I didn't even know he was there. I didn't even and I just, him. I just, I just saw, saw like a, there. yeah, I just saw like a face like buried in like pillows and blankets. And I was like, is that a guy? Like, what is going on? <laughs> isn't that a, isn't that a thing on Half Baked? There's like the guy on the couch. Oh, the guy on the couch. Yeah, <laughs> it was a Half Baked situation for sure. He did respond once. I forget what what the, the line was. Girl, like, get out. Get out. <laughs> get out of my house. <laughs> um, but, so in the, I always like to ask people what they're listening to. What are you digging, listening to, either at home or in the in the van or the truck? Um. I've been listening to um, some Johnny Paycheck, Word. some country. Um, you watched Tales from the Tour Bus? I just started watching that. I just oh, watched that episode, which shit. is why I've been getting into that. Um, <laughs> Courtney Barnett, I've been getting into her a lot. Um, what do you think, Malcolm? What about you? Uh, I've been listening to Ulrika Spacek a lot lately. They're, they're a band from, like uh, I think, over the Atlantic, maybe the UK. Um, idols, been listening Word. to them a lot. I've seen I've seen several idols shirts here. Yeah, it's like oh sweet, okay. Yeah, they're the, the, our homies uh, from Monster Watch like love that band, sweet. but I also really love that band too. But yeah, Monster Watch is another band. Yeah, really loved to see them. I th- I think I successfully yeah. missed them maybe both times, they but they were on my checklist. Show. Yeah, yeah. Some good homies of ours. Yeah. And then music from Tom, Tomas. <sighs> Tomas. Uh, yeah, going down like Soul Funk Road, been jamming on some Win- Winfield Parker lately. Yeah, dude. All right. Yeah, we'll have to pull up this 45. Yeah, and then obviously Dick Dale recently. Ah. Uh, yeah. yeah. All right. I know. Yep. Saw him in Denver a couple of years ago. That nice. was a great experience. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Yeah, yeah, for sure. How about you? Oh, shit. What am I? Uh, <laughs> Spotlight. That's like, oh, wait, what am I listening to? Um. Actually, I'm, I've been super into Sarah Shook and the Sarah Disarmers. Shook. Cool. So they're playing 11 o'clock tonight and then do have a main stage. It worked into my, to the move to the Southwest. Yes. So like it kind of cool. fit in and it was like, yeah, I, I'm drinking a lot at night and listening to, <laughs> like, to the country and she's kind hey, of we can hang out, man. Got, yeah, yeah. gotten me through. Um, so yeah, I'm hoping actually, hopefully like 
do a couple shots with her and, and talk cool. about stuff. Uh, so yeah, just drunken country punk essentially. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> love, it. love it. She's... Uh, I think they're from North Carolina. Oh, okay. And they've just been touring, touring, touring constantly. Nice. Yeah, and that's. I think that's this how. This is the show you're telling us about, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. We're gonna try to come to that tonight. Yeah. Sweet. It's, yeah. it's right up our alley because it's songs about drinking and stuff. So. She, <laughs> yeah. She's got a song called Dwight Yoko. Yeah. It'll be. <laughs> Good times. Chris King and the Gutter Balls. Thanks for talking to us here at the yeah. Record Exchange in Boise. Appreciate you. Yeah, yeah, man. Thank you. Have a good night. Yeah. Take care. You're listening to Media Monarchy with James Evan Filato. Since 2005, Media Monarchy has covered the real news about politics, health, technology, and the occult. All remixed with music and media that matters. Go to MediaMonarchy.com slash support and become a monthly subscriber so you can help keep independent, non-commercial, alternative media going and growing. Thanks.